Hey guys, what's up? It's Monkle Zonkey, and I had something to show you guys today. It's actually an, a really strange alternative for how to train your Dungeoneering that I thought uh, might actually work, so I wanted to try it out, and it turns out it does work. Uh, with the method I was training, I was getting about... Um, averaging out about 185k XP per hour and it's just a really strange way to train Dungeoneering. Now this way is not a good way to train Dungeoneering. I more just wanted to show this um, more as just something to understand um, that is a method out there that is just a really strange method. So um, this would have been useful if I had known about this when I was training my low level account in Dungeoneering. The bad thing about this method is you don't get any Dungeoneering tokens, which would definitely put most people off of training it. Um, but it is solo, which um, if you're if you are a lower Dungeoneering level, uh, I would say between level one Dungeoneering and about level 85 Dungeoneering before you can really start effectively training uh, on World 77 with teams. Uh, as long as you'd be okay with not getting tokens, this is actually a really good way to train if you are a very low combat level. I wish I had known about this uh, this method earlier when I was training on my low level account, getting to 80 Dungeoneering, and I had to mostly rely off of people in my friends chat to uh, help me out with Dungeoneering. If I did not have the luxury of making videos and being somewhat successful and having a friend's chat, there is absolutely no way that I had could have gotten to 80 Dungeoneering solo without it taking at least three times longer. I can say that uh, for a fact. So um, if for any crazy reason, I would not recommend this method just because of the reason that you don't get any tokens for doing it, but it's more just an informational video and something some something some of you guys might find interesting. So what you want to do, actually, this footage is not sped up or slowed down in any way. I believe it took me about three and a half minutes to do this. Uh, what you want to do is just rush a C6 um, dungeon floor, the high on a small size, not a medium. The highest floor that you can do. So for me, that would be 52 on my main account. Uh, but I realize not everyone has warped floors unlocked, so not everyone can go to that high. Um, but just the highest floor that you can do. Um, and the great thing about this is there is no uh, resetting involved. You never have to reset. I know a lot of people really hate resetting and having to do your complexity one floors. So you don't ever have to do that. And it also doesn't matter, you can just do the same floor over and over, just do your highest floor. So that's another plus. As I said, you know, the fact that you don't get any tokens makes this not a very effective method, but I, it's just something I wanted to put out there. Uh, you want to rush through your s highest floor, C6, small that you possibly can, open all the rooms, and immediately leave. Um, and what this will do is grant you um, amount of XP obviously varying on the floor that you do. Since I did floor 52, I got 10,700 XP for doing this. Um, and the reason why it's good is because you can rush through these C6 dungeons so fast that um, I think my record is I got one of these. Um, I did a C6 dungeon in like two minutes once before doing the boss. So you can actually do these incredibly fast and then you just leave and you do get XP for it. Um, I tried this out once on my low level account that is level 80 in engineering and I believe I got about uh, 4.7k XP or something like that. It was one of the lower occult floors that I did this on. So um, yeah, well, all you do is you rush through a C6 small dungeon, uh, you open every door except for the boss obviously and then you just leave and you do it again. Um, and you never have to reset, never have to do C1s. So I would only recommend this if you are, if you want to Dungeoneer solo on a low-level account. The other day I made a video suggesting that um, it actually might be a great idea to start a low-level account. And um, if for any crazy reason someone wanted to go down the path of trying to get a high Dungeoneering, um, this is really the only way I could see for getting a high Dungeoneering on a low-level account without either leeching or relying on friends. Um, so as you can see, I just finished up the dungeon, and it took me about three and a half minutes. You can do, do them faster, sometimes they take longer, and I got 10.7k XP. So, interesting method. I uh, just wanted to show you guys what this is, just in case there might be one or two people out there that don't care about tokens and might find it uh, a decent way to train. So, that's all. Thanks for watching, and farewell.